Here we presents the 5 best studio headphones. Let's get started with the list. Starting of our list at number 5. We've mentioned these before, and while audiophiles love to balk at the cheap price there is no denying that these are one of the best budget options available. You're not going to find flashy looks or fancy features here, but you will find sound that seems like it should cost a lot more. Monoprice seems to have a habit of doing that. The ear cups have a thick padding meant to keep loud noise on the outside of the headphones, and when you pair that with how loud these can get without too much distortion they're really worth the money. Of course, the ear cups also rotate a full 90 degrees which is perfect for only using one ear cup while mixing live. At Num 4. The AF-M50 X have a reputation as being a pair of studio headphones, but they're not as flat sounding as many people seem to think. Sure they're flatter than most headphones out there and they'll get the job done in the studio if you need them to, which is also what makes them such a great all-around pair of headphones, but I digress. But the headphones we mentioned previously are way better in terms of accuracy. Because of the bump in the low end of the FM50X headphones these are better for the musician that might need to feel that extra bit of emotion from the instrumentation while in the recording booth. For more information check out the description underneath the video. Halfway of our list at number 3. Bayer Dynamic is one of those companies that people trust just because of their reputation. They're known for great quality headphones, and the DT880 Pros are no exception. Besides being super comfortable thanks to padded velour earcups to keep your ears happy, they also have a decently flat sound with the exception of a slight peak in the 7kHz-11kHz range. If you're going to be mixing tracks and don't want the headphones you're wearing to color your mix at all these are a good pair of mid-tier headphones to look into. Of course if you decide to use these with mobile devices you're going to need an amp to power the 250O behemoths, but it might not work out for you as these are also semi-open back so sound leakage is going to be an issue. At number 2. Grotto is a headphone manufacturer in Brooklyn that makes some of the most respected products in audio. They usually have a somewhat minimal design with beautiful build quality and the SR60E just happens to also have a great sound for under $100. These are also open-back headphones with a leather strap holding the two earcups in place. You'll also get retro foam padding on the earcups that makes them easy to wear for extended periods of time. If you want good sound on a budget, the SR60E is a solid choice. And coming in at number 1 of our list. Sennheiser is one of the most trusted brands in audio and although there are plenty of debates over which of their headphones sound better, the HD800s are certainly in the conversation. These are large open back headphones that tell it like it is. Some people even say these might be little too much, to the point where they sound unnatural. They have a very flat sound with little to none distortion, crazy good detail, and a wide sound stage perfect for hearing every frequency range. There are mixed opinions on long-term comfort and everyone unanimously agrees that these are expensive, but if you're serious about audio they might be worth it. For more information check out the description underneath the video. Thanks for watching our video, for more, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to like and share this video.